Hey guys, how are you? So this is how to execute a sub scenario or another scenario uh, through Integromat. So here we have a scenario, an example of a, a Facebook Ads KPIs reporting scenario. So here, for example, um, we are getting a data from an API and then we are pretty much filling out that into a spreadsheet. So this is going to look like this. Um, and this is executed in two parts. So for example, if we execute this, this is going to only retrieve all of the data, but it's not going to retrieve the leads, neither the cost per lead, since that, that's another endpoint. So we can actually see this live. So let's run this once. And this is going to start generating this um, spreadsheet right here. And it's going to uh, pretty much traverse all of the campaigns uh, from our accounts. And then it's going to execute another sub scenario that is this one right here. Um, so actually I'm going to run this once and because this is going to be executed here. And I'm going to show you the implementation later. So I'm going to cut off here, I'm going to uh, wait for this, and then I'm going to show you how that looks. So you guys can see that this is pretty much finishing. This is going to execute this um, soon. So here it's executed. So if we go uh, here, we actually activated this scenario through a webhook. So that's pretty much the entire process. And if we look our uh, leads data, this is populating, so it's working. So now I'm going to explain to you how to create this integration. So first we need to create a webhook on the scenario we want to activate after. So if we go back here, we actually have a webhook. This webhook, it's from Integromat. You create the webhook by going into webhooks. You uh, create custom webhook, this one. And actually, let's let's connect this. Well, let's actually not connect this. Um, so here, we are going to add a new webhook. So for example, this can be example webhook. And we're going to click Save. And this is going to generate this URL right here, right? So in this case, we copy that URL. In my case, I'm going to delete this since I don't need it. Uh, I have this URL right here. So I'm going to copy this URL. And in this scenario, we have the thing we need to do is to create an HTTP request to that specific URL. In this case, it's this one. And we're going to actually use post. Uh, actually, webhooks are not limited to post. Um, but the problem is that in Integromat, when I'm trying to use get as an endpoint, the actual webhook, it's not executed. So if you want to actually execute this, you need to use post as a method. And you need to paste that URL. Then you don't need to add anything else. Uh, in case that you're uh, basing any time any type of data, for example, if you have like JSON, or if you are uh, passing like um, form encoded, um, or if you have multi-part that is pretty much images, files, uh, videos, those things, um, well, you can change that accordingly. But yeah, it's pretty easy. And if you guys need anything else, any other tutorial, I'm going to be uploading a few um, this week. So yeah, I hope that you have an amazing day, guys.